Hello everybody, I am Jennifer Yesterday, and welcome back to Yayui's main story. Uh, chapter 11, no, chapter 12, and Yayui has just come back from, uh, escaping his battle with- Oh, wait, we're in the middle of it. Huh? Hey, hang on! Yayui grabs me and hoists me into his arms. And with a burst of air, a wind scale emerges around us. You. Did you just do what I think you did? Absolutely. Yayue faces the stunned Abuki and taps on his head with a finger. You seem a little rusty up there. Better use your brain a little. As soon as Yayue makes his mocking retort, we're both lifted into the air. <laughs> Keep your mouth closed, Ayamina. You might bite your tongue. The wind scale doubles in strength. The wind speed whips up and tosses us high into the air while Kuruku slips himself inside. Kuroku! I still have something to discuss with you two. No twist now. Here we go. Our bodies gradually float higher into the sky. We can hear Ibuki's angry shouts and the other's amazed exclamations from the ground below. In the blink of an eye, Yayui's wind scale brings us to the Tsuki estate. Once we arrive at the main hall, I let out a sigh of relief. What a what an escape what a surprise that was. I had no idea Yayui would have would have escaped. <laughs> Did you see that, Ayamino? The look on that scoundrel's face? Yayui lets out an excited crutal turtle and pats me on the back. I then respond to Yayui. And um, Yayui? Yeah? About that wind skill you used. Was that the same one as I used? Yes, it was. I knew it! I remember when I used the same skill when we returned to the Spring Village. Speaking of which, I wonder how I was doing. Well, that's that for now. Now, up next, I am. Um, I'll be doing another one. I'm Jenny Beards, and I shall see you all later. Goodbye!